Hey everyone, Sales for Shorts here. Um, in this video, we're going to talk about compiling your Apex code. Um, so basically, what that does is, let's say you've you've made a few changes or you've created a new Apex class or test class. Um, sometimes you can probably get that error if you're trying to do deployment or doing a test run and it's telling you that you need to recompile it. Um, so so basically, the way to do that is you can just go to setup and then go to Apex classes. And yeah, basically what what will happen is once you once you compile it, it will it will sort of like check for any syntax errors, um, verifies the variables and methods exist, and it's and that it's used correctly. And then if that's all good, it'll tell you that it's pretty much a success. So if I go to Apex, I'll go to Apex classes. Then yeah, you'll see we've got quite a few different Apex classes here. Um, if you want to see more, you can just click more and then that'll show you the rest. And yeah, so if you want to compile compile all Apex classes, just click this button here and that's going to compile it for you. So depending on how many classes you have, it could take longer. So just wait for that to run and then yeah, you should see successful. If you do get error messages here, um, yeah, it will display it over here and then you'll obviously just need to find a way to fix it and then uh, try and run it again. So yeah, if you found this video helpful, please subscribe and check out our other videos. Thanks.